What's up, everybody? Ben Rez here for Odd Chopper. I am back. It is Wednesday, April 3rd in the sports world. Yes, there's no college basketball, but there's still plenty to bet on. The board is filled with plays. We're going to take one. We're going to put it on the board for our favorite bet of the day. That's what I do on this video. I give you one play, one play only. I do want to welcome you to Odd Chopper, though, all things betting. We got you covered for baseball, for basketball, for hockey, for other crazy stuff. Uh, I'm waiting for college football. It's not even close to being here, but in the meantime, Let's look at the odds board we've got right on Odd Chopper. I have been betting a lot of home run props. I've been sweating them out because there is some values. And again, it identifies these things. This is the type of stuff. If you are into sports betting, if you're looking for a process, if you're looking for tools that can assist you in finding value, that's what Odd Chopper is about. It's got a community built around that. It's got picks built around that. It's got tools built around that. If you want to see for yourself, if you want to see and join in on other people having success, Link is below. You can use my code. Why not save yourself a little money? But again, we'd love to have you as part of the community. It's a really good time. Speaking of a good time, before we get to the play yesterday, how about those sycamores? Uh, we needed that. Obviously, it's only two days into April, but it was nice to get a good win. They looked awesome. I think they're going to win the whole thing. We'll see. That's another video for another time. But yeah, shout out to Indiana State, who was the right side, in my opinion, yesterday, and they showed it. Now, let's get to the odds board. An odd chopper. So I'm in baseball streets today, as you can see, scrolling, scrolling, and I'm going to my squad, my hometown team, the Mets, the winless Mets, I should say, uh, because they are winless. In fact, so listen, it's early season baseball. Baseball is a grind no matter what. I, I'm of the philosophy, you know, I ease into the season once college basketball gets done, start to pick off some spots. But I do like the spot for one specific reason. Uh, so let's talk about these teams again. There's not much to say because they've only played a handful of games. But right now, it looks like the Tigers may go undefeated, uh, which would be quite impressive. If they do that, that really would be something. But they've looked awesome. The Mets are going winless, equally tough to do. They're 0-4. The game was rained out last night. Uh, so they've only played one game in this series so far. But I want to I want to hone in on the Mets. We'll talk about the Tigers in a second. But the Mets offense, truly, it's only been four games. But it has been abysmal. They've scored one, six, one, and no runs in the four games. Uh, most of that was against the Brewers, but they've had absolutely no production. Lindor's been, the, everyone has just been not hitting. Uh, will that flip? Of course it's going to flip. Will it be tonight? I have no idea. I really hope so. But one thing that I noticed, you know, the total's only seven in this game, slightly just to the over. So runs could be at a premium. Uh, in terms of the pitching, you've got Hauser on the mound. For the Mets, he comes over from Milwaukee. He was eight and five with 4.12 last year. I feel pretty good about that. Uh, again, I'm kind of setting the table. Let him give me a quality start. The Mets bats can only improve. And now let's get to it. Casey Mize is on the mound for the Tigers. Hasn't pitched in well over since 2022. Uh, Tommy John and back surgery. Pitched well in spring training. Got a spot in the rotation. I'm a little skeptical. Uh, a, I don't know how deep he'll go into the game. And regardless... I think there's a chance that, you know, when it gets serious like this, he could be knocked around a little bit. And if the Mets can jump out to an early lead and get into the bullpen, that will serve them very well, particularly in a game where we could see, you know, there's four, three equity, three, two equity, things of that nature. So I look at this and Casey Mize is the great unknown. Maybe maybe he's completely good to go and he picks up uh, right where he left off, I guess you could say. I'm willing to bet that that's not the case. Then, of course, the always the piece of the puzzle. Got to shop the line. Minus 126 is out there. It's up to minus 130. A little, you know, you're going to see those five, 10 cents, and you don't think it adds up, but it does. Vandal's got the number that I want. Chop it around. If you find 120, tackle it. Absolutely. But to me, this is just small little pieces. And of course, there is a, an element, uh, you know, that the Mets, the bats have to heat up here. Again, you get the rain out, you get to take a breather. You're 0 and 4. You're back at, you're still at home, I should say. Get into this Tigers bullpen and let's see what happens. I think they can get to Mize. I think Hauser gives them a quality start. Give me the New York Mets and a little baseball pick today to get the job done tonight. If you have any questions about anything, you know, I brought up some of the tools. If you want to see them more in depth, it, hit me up on Twitter. I'm happy to explain the process, the methodology, the data behind them. Again, these are tested uh, and it's a process. And of course, there's ups and downs, but it works. There's no doubt about it. I've been using it having a lot of success, and also getting bonus money uh, is a tried and true method. Just wish it was available everywhere, but it's not. But Bet365 is offering 5 into 150. Bet 5, win or lose, get 150 in bonus bets via the link below. 
You do have to be in Arizona or Indiana, Iowa, New North Carolina, New Jersey, Colorado, Louisiana, Ohio, Virginia, and Kentucky. If I said your state, you want some extra cash? It's there. Uh, you do have to be 21 plus, 18 in Kentucky. If you have a gambling problem, please call 1-800-GAMBLER. Happy Wednesday, everybody. Again, appreciate you checking out the video, putting a bet on the board, and hopefully cash and ticket. We're going to do it again tomorrow for Thursday. But for me, for the Tigers, for the New York Mets, enjoy the day. Enjoy the games, and I'll see you soon.